Lead the performance, Brafter. You guys better get footage yeah. of this clean. Yeah, because it's not going to be that way for long. Last. Hey Joe. What's going on? It's a Brapter Day. Oh yeah? Monday. Oh yeah. Going to pick up the Lethal Performance Brapter over at uh, Weikert Ford in Lake Wales. We're going to meet uh, Krista Pickens from Buckle Up Buttercup and we're going to have a great time. Let's do it. Yes, sir. Well, we're going to go and uh, take delivery of it. Yep. Check it out. And then we're going to take it right from the lot to the dirt. We're going to head up to the ranch oh, and get that thing dirty, man. Oh, man. Oh, yeah. I it's going to be the... filthy. <laughs> yeah. Covered in, like, nasty clay mud and stuff like that oh. right off the lot. Oh. All good. All in the name of fun, right? Yes, sir. Yeah, man. Yep. I'm excited. We've waited a long time for this thing, man. Yeah. It's been a while. Yeah. So, I mean, there's people that haven't even received their regular Broncos yet. Yep. that they ordered a few years back and here we are I mean we've got a first edition which is awesome and uh, the Bronco Raptor looks just insane I personally have not driven one yet I've seen them in person uh, at a Barrett Jackson show but um, to be able to actually be going up to pick up our very own Raptor is pretty exciting so it's here let's go get it Hey guys, Baby Billy here. We're over at Walker Ford in Lake Wales, Florida. These guys are the best Ford dealership around. They got all these wonderful vehicles on the lot right now. I see F-150s, I see GT500s, I see some Broncos. We got a Bronco Raptor here. We also got his personality called Buckle Up Buttercup. Look at this right here. We're doing it big over at, over at Walker Ford. Listen, you guys, come on in. I promise you, every purchase of a vehicle, you're going to get yourself a bag of Funyuns from me, all right? I love you guys. Baby Billy, and I'm out. I love it. Oh I love it. <laughs> She is uh, officially ours, yes. and we're going to go have some fun with her. Yes. It's really exciting. Is yeah. dirty? Yeah. Yeah, I know. I know. People are like, why would you do that? Take it right now. Because it's a raptor. Exactly. It's supposed to get dirty. I mean, we've been here before and taken delivery of vehicles, and we've done burnouts with our Shelby GT500 delivery here, just totally having professional race car driver, Billy Johnson, come out, doing burnouts in the lot here. So we have fun. Awesome. But this will be the first time actually taking this, to, like a vehicle like this, out to the ranch. Yeah. So I'm it's going to be pretty cool. I think we're going to have some fun. Uh, we're, we're definitely going to have yes. some fun. Let's talk about the freaking Brafter. Here we, we are. Raptor. Here we are, Wiker Ford in Lake Wales. Lead the performance, buckle up Buttercup. Chris is out here with me. So excited. And uh, we just took delivery of our Bronco Raptor. And when, how long have you been waiting? It's been built, it's been sitting for a while, right? I think it was scheduled in like July to be built and it wasn't actually built until August 24th or something like that, so it was pushed a little bit. And I mean, and it's been sitting for over two months. It's been sitting, it's, it's been sitting it's for a while. Halloween, like we've been talking about. Yeah, so it's two yeah, months it's, been, it's been a while. And you know, torture. from seeing it like on the site and you track it and you're like, built, and you're like, well, where is it? Exactly. And I kept on checking up with my Ford wrap and I'm like, hey, where's this vehicle at? I need it. And uh, finally, he's like, okay, it's, it's ready to go. So I was able to activate the Ford Pass um, while it was still at the plant awesome. before shipping, but not fully have it connected. Right. So. And uh, now, okay, can I ask you why you went with the code orange? Is it just because it's an exclusive color? Exactly. Same That's... reason we did with the, the lightning, you know, basically our uh, first edition, we did the, the lightning blue. Because it's the only other, it's, that's the only vehicle, Bronco, that's going to have right. that color to it. So, like, why not? Right. I, the code orange in person, I mean, we talked about this already, but it's, unless you see it in person, the videos and the pictures just don't turn out yeah. the orange that it actually it is. It looks red. It totally looks red in pictures. And yes. so, like, uh, and again, just when I, it showed up here, they sent pictures to my group, uh, to me, and then I sent them to my group, my employees, and they're like, so much for you know whatever I call it. they're like it's 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 red it's really like a pumpkin orange like that's yeah. how i can it's halloween it. and it's halloween that's right um so oh my god here we go i mean i've spent like a little bit of time with one of these at the uh, barrett jackson show just saw it in person right 
but this is like my first actual seeing a production vehicle here. So uh, I guess we can walk around, take yeah, a look at it, and let's see, look you know, around, mess around. Because there are some things on the inside that I'm not totally sure like what they do, and I don't know if you no, do. No. Like there's an R there, and it <laughs> the looks button. like the exhaust button, yeah. so I'm assuming it does. We're definitely going to mess with that yeah. for sure. Um, I mean, definitely. What what do you notice? The first thing that you notice that stands out different from obviously I mean, like. I mean, obviously the first thing everyone notices is always the flares. You either love them or you hate them. They're yep. growing on me now. Yeah. They're not terrible. No. I mean, the grill, I love it. I mean, it's just. Yeah. The hood vent. Yeah. The, the hood vent's vent. pretty rad, and I'm sure there's gonna be plenty of other options for stuff like that. Should we yeah. pop the hood? Yeah. Let's do it. Pop the hood. Let's see that three liter. Oh wait, this isn't gonna have. Oh no. wait, it's got hood oh, struts. Oh what? Rats. Oh my God! What? Look They're at that. They're actually using the brain. Look at that. And nice there she Ford is. performance right there. Oh, yeah. Look at it. It's so clean. Just right now. And the hood right props now. from the you, factory. You guys better get footage yeah. of this clean. Yeah. Because it's not going to be that way for gonna long. It's not going to last long. Someone give me a hand. I got to seriously. He's got to check the I'm oil. So, so, yeah. I gotta, yeah. I mean, honestly, I've got a four-inch lift on my Bronco with 35s, and I mean, this we're is about, still. We're almost. I mean, this, and this looks like a tad, a tad taller, taller than than yours. It's, uh, it's taller for sure. Yeah. So that's a bad motor, by the way. That motor is bad. If you guys don't know that three liter out of the Explorer ST, like those Explorer STs are insane. Right. I've you heard. know, they're super fast and especially with like just some basic mods on them and stuff. They go real quick. So this platform, the fact that they put it in the Bronco is going to be able to make, you know, you're going to be able to make more power and uh, easier as well. So can we rush Ford Performance on a calibration for this baby? You know what? I reached out to Ford Performance about it and uh, you know, I'm not going to say they gave me the official they're they're just I don't think they're there yet to do it and they haven't decided on whether they're going to do one yet or not. Oh, so, man. but I'm glad they came out with the one on the Bronco. Oh, I love it. I love it. And I want to I was saying um, earlier head to head these two and I know yep. you're going to smoke me, but with the calibration, I mean, it really oh, yeah. adds the power to mine. Like and, I am And you got a warranty. Sad, and you got a warranty. You have a warranty running a, right. an aftermarket calibration and still have a factory warranty yeah. in place, which is like it's a win. It's a substantial difference. Yeah. It is a substantial difference. I like, saw the video. You did a great job. I, if I you guys haven't it. seen the video yet, yeah, you definitely got to go out. to yeah. It's even in Ford Buckle Muscle Buttercup. Magazine. Yeah, it's like, awesome. It's, it's like out there. Thank so you. You did a great job with that. I you love guys it. did awesome. Well, thank you. We yeah. the performance team lead. Well, that's what we're here for. We have fun. You know, link up with other creators and stuff and people who are like-minded, share the same passion. Bronco, we love Bronco here at Lethal. I mean, yeah. like, uh, ever since, you know, we were, like, they came out with it and we're like, hey, we got to get one. It's a new thing, man. It's, it's been really good for us. And it's a whole community that goes with it, just like the Mustang stuff. I oh, mean, yeah. It's a whole community, and that's my favorite part. Definitely. Of all of it. Oh, yeah. No, I love it. I mean, that's, and it's a total, like, it is like a cult though, like a you know, like yes. Bronco people are like just like like Jeep people. We now we have our we, have, we have our thing. We need like exactly. a, a meeting, a group meeting of yes, yep. I have a problem. It's a Bronco problem. Yeah, seriously. I mean, definitely notice the suspension. Yes, um, the Fox, right? The Fox stuff. Yeah, look at the size of that thing over there, and and are very noticeable in the back, like the shocks. So the wheels, B locks, right here yep. from the factory. Love it. I cannot wait to feel the handling on this off-road. Yeah. I want to see you rip on it. Oh, Tear it up. We're man. gonna go over to the ranch here shortly. Like, I mean, it's so beautiful right now and clean and but everything else. But it's not else. gonna last. No, it's definitely it's not, not gonna, gonna last. last. And then we have things on the inside to yeah. kind of figure out. Let's do it. Like, what it is. So, but like, you see the steering wheel and stuff like that. I mean, just, you notice, you notice things a lot yeah. once you open it up here. I mean, just, let's just talk about looking at it, just looking <sighs> at it on the inside. You don't feel like you're in a Bronco. I mean, it's luxurious yep. for sure. And I'm gonna feel pretty guilty getting this thing all dirty. Nah, but just not all at all. The no Raptor shame on that. <laughs> no shame. On the seats yeah. and the center console and the steering wheel. I'm so happy you went with a carbon fiber look yep. on it. Just it just looks so I actually good. had no idea what what pieces would be carbon fiber at all, but I mean I like the accents where enough. it looks good. Yeah. Yeah, it's, it's just enough. Real little nice over here by the handle. I don't know if you notice this, the badging. It's got the Ford Performance Look at little that. touch. Yep. There's a lot of Ford Performance touches all throughout. You got the door sills. Um, you know, some badging everywhere. There's got to be some Easter eggs, I'm sure, floating oh, yeah. around here. There's Ra a lot. You know, a, a Bronco lot. Raptor Easter eggs floating around. And look at this. The seatbelt. Yeah. Like those edges. are rad. Like dude, 
Come on now. And even the stitching in the seat matches the code orange. Like it's just beautiful. Really nice. But there's a lot of things up here. I think that's adaptive cruise control, but there's things up here that we don't exactly know. I mean, we kind of yeah, have an idea. A little bit. But we're gonna have to figure it out. And um, by the way, the paddle shifters, check that out. <gasps> yes, look so at that. That, uh, that I don't have that on, on my Bronco, right? No, we no, don't have that no, on first edition. No, so. that's a Raptor thing. Yeah. Hey, what's up, Philip? Yeah, man, let's Do head over to the ranch and go have some fun. Yeah, I know, right? What kind of question is that? Seriously, we haven't even gone through this whole vehicle yet, and we're already off to the ranch to get her dirty. Let's do it. We're going over to the ranch, straight to the dirt, to get her dirty. Getting the Raptor dirty, and we're going to send it. That's right. Let's go. Woo! Wait, 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 wait. Oh. Buckle up, Buttercup. Buckle up, Buttercup. <laughs> Team Lethal in the house. Let's go. Man, Jared, you get this thing all dirty, man! <laughs> <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> 